laugh, monster. But let me remind you, within that weak sack of meat and bone, uncared for by his god and wept for by none, beats a heart, the human heart, that carries with it the strength and courage of all mankind. Within that sack of meat is ensconced the hope, the will, and the fury of every man, woman, and child from every corner of the Imperium. Within that weak sack of meat, festooned in thin armor and weapons only powerful in numbers, beats the heart of a man! And for 10,000 years, the hearts of men have beaten strongly in defiance of your so-called powers. For 10,000 years, the hearts of men have stood united against a galaxy that despises them for no reason save that they have the audacity not to lay down and die. For 10,000 years, you Black Crusades have been pushed back, beaten down, and made a mockery of by weak sacks of flesh with cheap weapons and disposable equipment. But that weak sack of flesh that you so gleefully mock is no super soldier, no immortal warrior, no creature cursed by chaos like you! He is a man. An Imperial Guardsman, drawn from some forgotten corner of the Imperium to fight for his species and for the safety of the people he loves. He's a factory worker, a farmer, a storekeeper, a father, a brother, a son, a mere man. And against creatures like you, teeming and numberless, powered by the very will of a thirsting god, he holds the line. And he has held the line for 10,000 years. So, what's your excuse, monster? Hello, it is I, Ariman the Exile. If you are watching this, today we are gonna speak about uh, uh, Dawn 4 Lost Memories. Yeah, something like that. I'll probably put it in the description. Uh, because we are gonna see some old pictures when we played, uh, like we had a good times, you know, and stuff like that. We have lost many battles, win many, win a lot of battles, lost a lot of battles, so yeah, we are just fighting, surviving in this Warhammer universe, which is very big, and surprisingly I have a story to tell you about uh, some lost memories, some people who will not play anymore, some uh, different mods, uh, like from, uh, I don't know, like, let's say, from Soulstorm, uh, then tit Titanium Wars, like, Down of Four Codex, uh, I don't know, Unification Mod, Ultimate Apocalypse, and stuff like that, stories like that, like, and, yeah, of course, Colosse Down of Four Colosseum Mod, like, I always liked uh, those things. And today we're gonna like watch a couple like pictures I took from the battles in the game. I had fun uh, playing uh, through these years. It was a long journey. It was so enjoyable. And we're gonna check them out like one by one picture. Uh, I will not name the people from those battles. If you want to, you can pause the video and you can probably, I don't know, see it for yourself. Like who was who, with who was I playing, like... Those people, those, those people uh, are past. We have to move forward now and it's over. Like, we had a good time. Uh, I have a lot of pictures I want to show you and share with you on this internet platform. Uh, YouTube, yeah, alright. So, 
shall we see them? Yeah. I also, uh, if we get to the end of this video, maybe I will, I don't know, uh, show you my like uh, tabletop figures because it reminds me of also of a good time which we played. Uh, you will see, you will see. I will speak no more. Like, we're gonna see some pictures and we're gonna uh, share the experiences, yeah? Like, as I said, like, this, this, those uh, moments happen like two years, maybe three, maybe, I don't know, year before this. So, I just hope this microphone works. We're gonna see them like one by one picture. Because why the hell not? Like I'm, I came up with this uh, content. It's a, it's a good thing, you know. You, we need to see them. Like I have a lot of pictures to. I not, not that many actually. Like I know, I, I could have have like many more because I had so many battles. I even don't know, <laughs> man. <laughs> well, through the years, you know, it was uh, like a lot of fun. Like uh, I always played for fun, though, and. I enjoyed playing playing it, uh, but some people are just past. Some people are gone. Yeah, basically gone. I don't know. Like, uh, if if you find yourself from this video, like, please consider uh, subscribing. <laughs> I don't know what else to tell you because uh, I do not have time like uh, before. Like a lot of things uh, happen in life, so I, yeah, I usually don't have uh, enough time to to share experience true number one all right we had uh, me is this a full screen like yeah, yeah. Uh, probably it is can i turn this background into the i don't know like yeah it's it's, it's a good background i like it so far like uh all right as we can see here this is great cabal citadel that means i was playing uh ultimate apocalypse and I just hope this microphone works because I'm not even sure uh, don't know what the hell was this uh, <laughs> but I had a agony titan as we can see in the background like uh, ultimate were like really good time like I, I uh, knew how to play all of the races in the ultimate apocalypse like yeah, we gonna you, you can see my re resources here. I was that good, yeah, back in the old days. I don't know when that happened, but it happened. And oh yeah, let me tell you, we had many battles, many journeys we have been through. So let's go next. All right, we can see now Imperial Guard. It was a playback. I do not know how many this, uh, how many years has been since I have this picture on my computer, but okay. I don't know, for each picture, I, we don't wanna see, uh, we just gonna like scroll and see what, what do we have. Aha, uh -huh, another picture of Godsman. Ah, this was me playing uh, some Chaos uh, Space Marines. All right, yeah, I knew how to play Chaos Space Marines as well, so yeah. Now I see I had that uh, Hellsmith, had that uh, Zenich Sorcerer Lord, yeah, that was him, yeah, yeah, alright. I had the, like the world, world eaters uh, color for, for them, <laughs> alright, all right. uh, a couple upgrades in the armory, alright, uh, we have some guardsmen. Yeah, you can see like this. I, I took a picture from this. Yeah. And then we had me playing as Godsman. Uh, I had uh, this base. This was a free for all match. The map called Ultimate Apocalypse. We can see here like this was a glorious moment. Like I was, uh, I was probably winning this. Like we played a big free-for-all match on the map called literally ultimate apocalypse and i had this i had all of those things uh, and i had this economy so i was great back in the old days actually i had the imperator titan two basilisks uh walls 
Imperial, uh, this uh, General Titan, River General Titan, I had everything, like, uh, and I had the map domination for sure, like, I killed, uh, I have united with somebody, actually, and, uh, like, it was uh, a lock team's no, so, <laughs> so everybody, everyone could, like, uh, be uh, with anybody, you know, like, and I played solo after I beaten, like, two... Uh, or one fella like I uh, somebody don't, didn't want to wanted to fight against me so he kind of joined and I was like okay you better join now because I'm about to kill everybody <laughs> and I was winning like the whole thing yeah uh, Basilis Magnus yeah it was insanely good uh, yeah we can see from this perspective also oh yeah oh yeah now yeah this is the vision. I, uh, I yeah, this was one hour game. It lasted like more. Game was paused. I don't know why the game was paused. Ah, this is a playback. Yeah. <laughs> so probably I won this. I don't know. I don't even know. I cannot remember. But I think I won this with somebody who played at my at my side. Uh, this was Agony Titan. Yeah, I kind of did this damage to the Agony Titan. I believe I was using like super weapons, like laser and stuff like that, and nukes. I was bombarding it, and I was shooting it with the Basilix. Basilix was uh, Magnus was like the global weapon. It can shoot literally anywhere. If you only have vision of the enemy, like you can sh shoot it from any distance, like. Basilis Magnus don't care. Um, yeah, this was me. This was me. All right. Uh, on the second place were like Space Marine player. Yeah. All right. Dark Elder player was with that Agony Titan. Yeah. And we probably added that one AI. I don't wanna like uh, as I said. I don't wanna read like the names of the players. So it's up to you if you want to. Oh, all right. What 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 did we have here? We were using the Discord, and uh, yeah, I kind of had two Imperator Titans at the same time. <laughs> my god, I was brutal then. Yeah, I played Inquisition. This was all my work, probably. Yeah, I dominated this map. This this map is uh, for four players. As I can tell, I don't know the name of the map, but I know this map is made for four players. And I had this. This means I probably win against everybody. And I had maximum economy, bro. So I was like, I don't give F, man. I'm going to destroy anything on this map. So <laughs> I was brutal then, yeah. <clears throat> Alright, what do we have here? Obliterators. Alright. Yeah, each, each uh, race I'm playing, like, I always have a good economy. This is my uh, obliterators. Like, I had this many obliterators. We probably played the 2v3 or 2v2, I don't know, something like that. But we can see I have uh, dominated with my obliterators on this match. Like, it was a long, like 29 minutes actually, and it was in the game. And this moment was, this picture was took in the game actually. So I could have moved and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this was in the game. Yeah, nice. This was also in the game. This was me playing uh, as uh, Space Marines. And we can see my economy was incredibly good. Yeah, they probably nuked me with uh, with stuff. So that is why I had like zero going uh, power. But I had maximum uh, uh, 1000 of uh, blue going. So yeah, I... We can we can see like I I, I played really good. <laughs> All right, I, I back in the old days. Look how many HP my chapter master had. Oh yeah 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 yeah. That was a broken times actually. I knew about the glitches and uh, broken stuffs. So yeah, I knew how to do basically anything. Like I learned so fast, incredibly fast. I was only playing every day, every day, like every day, bro. bro it was a good. Good old days, like almost every day I played uh, down of four back in the old days, actually. So and this this conversion beams, bro, <laughs> it melts titans for dinner. So it it was casual, one of the best uh, vehicles in the game. But more than that, 
more than this tank i liked uh, some something else actually it was uh oh my god this hp is actually very broken but i like it i like it so far oh we can see like even terminate that that happens with the emperor's armories you can like stock your emperor's armories and then you can increase your hp the enemy uh like probably allowed us didn't allow us we we were defending ourselves like really good and as we can see i was playing against sisters and i i took the control of almost of the whole map this was in the match so yeah this was probably free for all uh four players so yeah this this happened also <laughs> good stories good moving on i don't know what the hell was this yeah Oh, this is two end games actually in one place. I was playing uh, Chaos Space Marines, and that's the end of the Chaos Space Marines end game, and that's the end game of the Dark Elders actually. So we kind of had two end games, or even three, because I see two Cataclysm. Yeah, I see two two of them. So we kind of uh, we were playing this on this four v four actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. And me and that fella, he was playing really good, and we did this. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, as we can see, like I had multilators in this. Uh, they were dealing like insanely good damage. They were elite troops. I was kind of like, not always, but most of the time I was going for the Zenich, uh, Zenich uh, mark of chaos. When I played, uh, of course. Uh, as the Chaos Space Marines. Now moving on. Oh yeah, this is also my work. Incoming like uh, 2000 uh, blue resources and incoming maximum 800 of power. And I had three Gargans made like literally. That's unstoppable, bro. Nobody couldn't like stop me back in the old days. Like, and I had those Armageddon's uh, battle fortresses vehicles and I had like really a lot to show my enemies back in the old days actually that this was uh, 45 uh, 45 minutes <laughs> and as we can see I was still in the game like they had no chance against these free gargans back in the old days and yeah the, I, I did good I did great actually yeah I'm impressed <laughs> I was playing that good, yeah. But if you ask me now, I probably couldn't play that good back. In... All right, what is this? Ah, yeah, free for all. Uh, me with Imperator Titan, like <laughs> wandering around. <laughs> I probably took two heads, and the last player was like playing, like I don't know, like some camping race, like Necrons and. He was probably waiting on me to to do some move, and when he saw like two players died, like this map is insanely. And I played Space Marines with, with and I had Imperator Titan. Yeah, I I was building here also a thermonuclear, and I had the Emperor Armory, as we can see. So those things are like the last end game stuff. All right. Uh, okay, okay, okay. This was four before some matchup. Aha, uh -huh, I see, I see. Necrons, Orcs, Chaos, Space Marines, Godsmen against Inquisition, Orcs, Godsmen, and Space Marines. We totally won. Alright. I don't know what the hell was this. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there is a way. I believe I did this. I did this. Uh, there is a way when I did this, like, you can just spam your Titans, like, when you research your end game, it, this happens. This happens, so I believe I, I I did this also. So you can have more than two thousand uh, for your incoming of the blue requisition because there is a way like you can increase your uh, blue requisition to even uh, three thousand and five hundred, probably something like that, and that's the maximum tyranids uh, can go, and all other races cannot go that uh, that much, but. In the late games, Tyranids kind of have uh, weaker stuff than the other races. But yeah. If you know, then you know. 
And the orcs, I believe, they kind of have 2,000 requisition for, uh, yeah, for requisition. And power 1,000 would be, uh, 800 actually, yeah. Just like everybody else. Yeah, as we can see here, I believe I, d I played orcs. And we can see how many squigs I had. Like, yeah. It was probably some random thing, like I was I I was planning to go with the squigs. And this is how much squigs I can like build in this time. When you go to that uh, extra DACA thing and when you research that thing on level tier two I believe, then you can have all of this. Then you can do whatever the hell you want with orcs actually. And yeah, everybody was scared. <laughs> <laughs> about big war. Uh, this was unification mode, I believe. I don't know what was this. Probably some uh, computers. All right, computer four. Uh huh. We can see salamanders, witch hunters. Ah, uh, this was the this was the time when I was watching. Uh, uh, all all pl all AIs fighting each other. That was for me. It was a fun to watch, actually. All right, what do we have here? We have uh, probably something like that, like AI fighting and stuff. I was like defeated, or I killed myself. I don't know. Uh, you have been annihilated. Uh, don't know what the hell happened here. This was a playback. I usually take pictures when I win, maybe, I'm not even sure. Yeah, yeah, I won, I totally won. This was me playing as uh, Grey Knights with uh, actually people against people, free on free. This map is made free for free on free. So yeah, I know about this map. Uh-huh, we played into the bridge, classic map. I I kind of like like this color for space marines. So yeah, all right. Uh, Emperor's children. All right. All right. Oh, we kind of played uh, into the bridge, but free for all. That was also good. I was playing witch hunters, and we all probably randomed. <laughs> I don't know who he, who the hell won in this battle. Uh, all right, what is this? We were probably waiting for eight players. We had on Discord so many people back in the old days, actually. Uh, mm -hmm. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I see this. I see it. Ah, ooh, free for all on this map. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. I was playing Steel Legion. We had Salamanders, Witch Hunters, Adeptus Mechanicus, Adeptus Ritus. Interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I played even Steel Legion back in the old days, of course. And this was me playing as uh, Black Templars. Also a playback. Don't know what the hell happened here, but something probably did happen. And yeah, I am I am planning to do Down 4 in the future. Like, if you are new to the channel, consider yourself subscribing. Because those pictures we are, we are watching today... Those pictures actually happened in real time. So yeah. All right, moving on. We had this uh, same map, Yalahanda Lovelands, made for two v two v two v two. Oh yeah. How could I? How, how could I not forget this map? Like we played this map so much that I don't even know in which mod I played. Probably ultimate and the unification, yeah. So that that was good old times. <laughs> and even even in Soulstorm, I believe. But no, 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 no. It wouldn't be a Soulstorm. I usually play only mods. So Mockingbird, Harlequins, Harlequins. Yeah. How did this happen? Mm -hmm. All right. Mm hmm I see. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We had this map uh, playing eight players straight, bro. Free for all. <laughs> this was awesome thing. Yeah, back in the old days, like, uh, 
they uh, steam had preloads all right but but the way we played we played through dove online after we figured out like there is a way like we can all play and we can still do that we can still do that we can all play on the servers like uh through dove online pirate version steam version the the launcher does not care actually like that launcher made by russians russian community of course they are fucking awesome and i kind of like uh, uh, recommend you to download dove online so we can all play like this many people in the matchup like oh my god that was really good we had black templars the lost and the damned emperor's children salamanders witch hunters i was astra militarium which were the imperial guard adeptus mechanicus and necrons oh awesome uh, uh what do we have here yalhanda yalhanda lowlands yeah i called it I know about this map like usually we play this map too we do we do we do so this was this map was brings a lot of a lot of memories actually I believe we played on this map for like four and a half uh, hours which was the my my record uh, in Dawn 4 actually I believe when we had uh, like a really lot of people on the server like and I stayed for like four fucking hours and even more than that, almost five. So yeah, I kind of remember that everybody was screaming like, oh my God, we cannot believe like Ariman, you are playing for like four and something hours. And I was like, yeah, yeah, <laughs> come and join us if you want my friend. Yeah, made up for two, we two, we two, we two. All right, moving on. Oh, oh. <laughs> We also played on this map. <laughs> oh, I have really good memories about this map. Yeah. <laughs> also made for 2v2v2v2. Two, 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 two. All right. Yeah. We can make the. Uh, basically, we can now make a fun like this uh, even now because uh, Dove Online is even more upgraded now. It faster downloads. Uh, it's it faster loading, uh, faster, uh, faster going your game and stuff like that. So, and no crashes. Uh, I mean, if only like game can crash from the beginning, but usually that happens. But with this Dove Online, it won't even happen like that much. So I, I recommend you if you didn't ever had a Dove Online, consider it uh, like downloading it from the site. It would probably tell you something like it's a virus, but bro, I was playing on Dove Online for years, bro. So try it, believe me. Uh, if you if you can like just enable your PC to like download that thing, it doesn't like require that many. Actually, probably 100 megabytes, which is not even much in these days. So moving on. Uh, Ah, good and all the memories, bro. When we played with eight people, bro. Yeah, that actually happened. <laughs> okay, what do we have here? Oh, we played also this. We were probably waiting for people. Oh, yeah. All right, this was me playing against all other races for some reason. Okay. What did we have here? We had like free on free. Oof, that was also good. Also nice thing to do. Like this map is also really good for free with free matches. Like I had also really good fun on this map back in the old days. I can remember those fucking aircrafts and stuff. Oh my god. And some players who were like screaming about those uh, same aircrafts, like, how could I counter them? <laughs> I never uh, checked the, what do you say it? Yeah, like tutorial videos, like I usually sp skip that part, you know, it's, it's a love level for me. So as we can see, I was playing AI difficulty harder even uh, later on insane so yeah i i don't waste my time i if i find about the, like glitches and stuff 
I would probably use them against you because if you don't know about them and I know it well man I don't know what to tell you like I play to win bro I, uh, we had this conversation in the back in the old days like those people are now uh, I don't know where and what are they doing but I just want to share some pictures with you, okay? All right, what what did we have here? We had like orcs, witch hunters, yeah, some fun stuff, okay? We even had Imperial Guard, yeah. Is that the Tech Marine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Black Templars, Chaos, Space Marines with the horrors, maybe even a Chaos Demons. I don't even know. Oh, I can see a uh, Legion of the Damned, okay. Mm -hmm. I, can, I can see the blood leathers now playing together with Black Templars, which is not a good thing, actually. <laughs> Alright, we had the Death Jesters. Death Jesters! Oh, man, how did I hate those units. Especially when the player knows how to play them. Uh, like, those units, Death Jesters, are really not to be, like, uh, fucked with, you know? Like, they cost a lot. And they deals a lot of damage in uh, they deal deal a lot of damage in in uh, range. So when you upgrade them with those bright lancers, pfft, it can be terrible for your infantry, even for your vehicles. So it's almost unstoppable. Like you have to jump to them, like with your I don't know assault marines to cut them. Like you have to hunt them down, and plus they can move fast. So yeah. Oh, they can be pain in the ass, probably. All right, what do we have here? Chosen Marines. I was playing Chaos, and I was beating the Harlequins in this scene. But it is what it is. And yeah, we can see in the background, like, that was the filler. Like, Harlequins didn't have that much of the stuff. But I had, like, those uh, Chaos Marines, chosen, pardon, chosen Marines, who were excellent at melee, Excellent and uh, range. This mod was probably called Titanium Wars. I'm not even sure. Uh, all right, we had uh, again this scene. Oh, that was me with the Prince Demon now angry as ever, chasing those dead chesters on the global on the map, bro. Yeah, as I said, like they they were pain in the ass. Like any good player who knows how to play those. Harley Quinn's Dead Jesters, be aware of the Dead Jesters, bro. Like, you don't uh, let them live. You strike them down immediately. Alright, uh, me as a Space Marines on this. As Ultramarines, pardon me. Uh, we had, uh, alright. What is this? An AI? Oh, this Chaos Lord model uh, looks uh, fantastic, actually. Uh, what do we have here? Probably waiting for other players. Yeah. All right. Good old days. Oh, we played some free for all with Chaos Space Marines, me as a Demon Hunters, uh, another player with Orcs, and another player with Petroian Guard. Oof. That was great, actually. I cannot remember who won, but I remember. Wait. But I remember a couple things, like maybe I killed this Petroian Guardsman, or even Orcs. I don't even know, I had so many battles back in the old days. Alright, this mod was probably something like, I don't know, Alpha Legion, because we can see like this Possessed Marine looks like a snake. So yeah, 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 this was Alpha Legion mod, probably, I don't even know. And this was unification mode. The old version, 468 actually. But, as we can see, that's a Grandmaster of the Dark Angels. Ah, yeah. Angels of Absolution, bro. And the Dark Angels, alright. And then back in this, we had uh, Night Lords and Petroian Guard. So, yeah, probably. And they removed. Uh, Petroians and Night Lords, so they can like they could like work on them, so and they could add some stuff. Well, that was great. 
uh, in this pu future time, like I believe we have uh, have them right now. We, you you can play as a knight uh, lords or you can play as a Petroian guard. It's up to you if you like them. Like I enjoyed playing uh, knight lords back in the old days. Uh, uh huh. Those were like this third thirty company space wolves. All right. Uh huh. We had a master bike, and we had a. Uh, uh huh. That what is his name? The tyranny, the commander. All right. Fatal error. All right. Oh, probably game crashed. All right. I don't even know. Hmm. Okay. Ah, uh -huh, Necrons. Yeah. Ah, this was when I showed my friend uh, about Necrons. This is why I took like, uh, like first updates on the Necrons, like vo new voice acting for for Necrons in Unification mode. Like, it was excellent. I enjoyed showing like Necrons uh, to my friends. Like, yeah, yeah. My uh, one of my friends actually in real life uh, have collection of army. Uh, of Necrons and if we like if I remember till the end of this video maybe I will I don't know I will uh, uh, show you those uh, pictures also bit because that was also a fun time uh, I have my army of own and I will show you also probably at the end of this video now moving on uh, oh that's a void void the dragon yeah, yeah yeah I know how to summon him now <laughs> I can still remember some stuff Oh yeah, this this vehicle, Doom Cycle. Yeah, that that's insanely good vehicle. Um, all right, uh, this is one of the Overlords, this Mother of Oblivion, and that's a Titan. That's a Titan for Necrons. That was the first Titan. Like uh, uh, I saw, I was playing. I can remember one match uh, when I was playing against Imperial Fists, and that fella was like. I don't know, probably it was 2v2, with two six player match, and uh, or even 3 for all, I don't even know, like, so much battle happens. But I can remember, he sent the whole army of the Imperial Fists, he had so much economy, but he and I sent Necrons and I had this Titan. The only thing survived against his army was uh, actually uh, this Titan and my Necron Lord, and then uh, he defeated my army, but casualties were like pfft, he lost like almost the whole army and Rogaldorn, which is a primarch of the imperial fists were leading him leading his army and he survived uh, he and a couple of units and i lost the whole army okay then i did some magic i used a resurrection orb Resurrected the whole army and boom! I had the whole Necron army again. Didn't use a single power point. So, yeah. <laughs> and my, uh, he saw that uh, Necron Lord to a Nightbringer. Yeah. And he was fighting Rogaldor. And yeah. <laughs> that was. That was. And he was like, oh damn, now I am now I'm going to lose. And then the Titan. Like he came in, he wanted to do some little bit of melee stuff, you know, and he was like, damn, I lost the whole u uh, troops out there. We were using like normal uh, uh, unit infantry and vehicle uh, caps. So, yeah, that is how we used to play uh, back in the old days. So, yeah, all right. And then he uh, managed to like just rage quit. Like he said to me like, bro, damn. You won. I'm leaving. <laughs> but he had fun. Also like I did. Moving on, alright. Uh Doomsday are oh wow man. This this is like classic, like classic stuff. Like this vehicle is awesome, man, as hell. I, I always like to produce Doomsday Arc. Because this vehicle is artillery and it will do a lot of damage. All right, moving on. Annihilation Bridge. Yeah, it's you know when you have Doomsday Arc, you should probably go for this vehicle too. <laughs> uh, okay, the Infinite Trison, the Infinite. Yeah, yeah. Overlord, Necron Overlord, Pylons. 
how much did I hate those things when you play against them? <laughs> mm. But when you have them on your side, it's completely a different story. <laughs> okay, I don't know what is happening here. Moving on. Startup, some startup of the match. Uh, then we have this. Sync error detection. Some Imperial Fists. Player. Uh, Celestian Sisters. I don't know why did I took picture of this, but okay. Oh. <laughs> Ladies. <laughs> and we can see in the background the Vulcan. <laughs> uh, this was me playing Salamanders. Uh, I can see that. Much. All right. Yeah, nice models. <laughs> okay. Um, no, no, wait a second. Uh, wait a second. Ah, there we go. Uh, we had Blood Ravens, not Blood Ravens, uh, Blood Angels, and Imperial God. I don't know. Probably I was playing uh, as a Blood uh, Angels against Godsmen. Mm. Yeah, I didn't know how was that probably going to be, but it was that moment. Playing against AI probably on insane or harder, testing my skills. Ah, Sorcerer Lord. Yeah, there he is. Yeah, such a classic thing. <laughs> Map made for four players. So, or AIs. Depends, like one human and three AIs. Yeah, stuff like that. So, Sorcerer Lord uh, is close to the relic. And he's like, this relic is mine. <laughs> okay. What do we have here? Oh, this was me like upgrading my skills, playing against insane AIs. We can see here AI difficulty, quick starts. Oof, that's insane. Uh, what is this? Uh, oh, yeah, this mod is called uh, White Scars. Yeah, 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 yeah is actually uh, you know what this mod is actually broken uh, yeah like those uh, you can produce terminators in your listening posts and I believe it's it's a broken mod uh, don't download it it's a waste of time but white scars as a new faction would be lovely to see in any match uh, like why not all right uh, moving on we have uh, steel legion I believe uh, you have annihilated the enemy Probably me playing as a uh, Steel Legion. I cannot see because, all right. Uh, Commander Dante with his Blood Angels. Yeah, the Golden Warrior. Who doesn't know about him? Oh, we can see some aircraft now. Ooh, lovely, lovely. Good to see. Okay, we can see some uh, Grey Knights fighting against uh, Blood Letters. That's a matchup. That's a cool matchup, actually. Um, nice picture. Fighting over the relic. <laughs> nice. Uh, there was me like saving some games. Lamenters, Lamenters. All right. Oh damn you, Lamenters! Why did you have to die? <laughs> uh, Grey Knights uh, going on some demon world. All right. Uh, standing there and they stand there <laughs> one foot all right uh, uh, we got Slanesh Lord some Emperor's children with some uh, Volkai guns uh -huh. uh, chaos sorcerer of the niche he's like a lower rank than me I am Ariman after all but he listens to me, he's a good fella. I had a really good time with this fella. Uh, again, some games. Uh, Imperial Fists, I believe this map is on survival. Um, yeah, okay, what do we have here? Uh, Celestian Angel. Probably Ultimate Apocalypse or Unification mod, stuff like that. Legion of the Damned. In this time, I believe I played Unification mode a little bit. I was like, uh, yeah, you have every match, like multiplayer matches, even on the on my channel. Like in, you can check out in the past, you can find it. 
you can uh, really find you by yourself if you're like I believe I also have that match with uh, Titan and uh, uh, Necrons when I played Necrons I just resurrected the whole army and he was like ah damn man I, I don't want to play anymore <laughs> alright what do we have here still Legion of the Damned that's a venerable dreadnought and land raider such a nice screenshot actually and this is his units who are invisible actually you can upgrade them and give them invisibility uh, this is probably like a new model of the knight for the adeptus mechanicus i believe yeah adeptus mechanicus fighting against necrons here we can see a lot of dead bodies there mm -hmm. and that's more knights like three or even more i don't know um, Salamanders, Salamanders use uh, Primaras, Primera Space Marines, there they are, some uh, veterans, what do we have here next, uh, Sergeant of Primera Squad, maybe even a Lieutenant, uh, oof, Centurions, yeah, alright, those fellas are really scary, you don't want to fight against them, uh, yeah, they're all Salamanders fighting against Orcs here, huh? Uh huh. Some Grey Knights, some Black Templars now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Even the Sword Brethren, who are like Terminators, those are classic Sword Brethren. Oh yeah, Imperial Fist, Sons of Dorn, Primaris Marines, with hammers, yeah, and candles. <laughs> All right. And destroyer squad, destroyer unit, you can give them like uh, a lot of upgrades. This this upgrade you can see like it's really f good. Uh, Kairogan, yeah. And some uh, sergeant, uh, sergeant, yeah, probably sergeant, who is Primaris Marine, holding those plasma baster blasters. Uh, and you can see even in background the night. <laughs> I took such uh, great screenshots in this game actually. Oh, that's the Imperial Fist soldiers. Uh, some Necron. Uh, what was the name of them? Death Marks. Yeah, Death Marks. Lich Guard. And the Warhound. There is a Warhound in our troops. Played as the Space Marines here. Uh, this chapter is uh, I don't see the sign I don't even know uh, huh. we have those Necrons ne Necron Pylon in the background and uh, what is this probably fighting against Imperial Fists here and Elder uh, even okay they seem like allies actually oh it's a survival it was a survival mode probably me Playing as the, those Imperial Fists and Necron player. Uh, well, yeah, okay. Survival mode, indeed. Legion of the Dame. Uh, Firehawks. Yeah, I believe Firehawks lost in the uh, Legion of the Dame. Uh, we have Black Templars for Brethren here. And that's uh, Stellion. A captain of the Black Templars. We have two corrupted the Warhounds of Chaos here, even, and a lot of obliterators. Damn, even some uh, multilaters. Then we have uh, Deep Strike Land Raiders with Thunderhawks, some Stormtroopers here on the battlefield fighting against needs. All right. Yeah, yeah, this Thunderhawk, uh, you can deep strike your uh, land rangers when you when you wanna go like for stormtroopers uh, in unification mode, I believe. Yeah, you can also deep strike them in Ultimate Apocalypse. You can see the, those are the needs in the background. Uh, destroyer vehicle and those Valkyries, but I don't know. You can use them. Maybe you can now in this upgraded version of the unification mod. Um, that's a storm blade. Storm blade. Uh huh. We got some ultramarines now. Excellent. Ooh, basilisk, shooting from the sky, brothers. 
Artillery ready. Yes, my lord. Where do you want us, my lord? <laughs> uh, okay, we have some dark angels here. All right, interesting. Master of the bikes. Yeah, all right. Oh, some corrupted uh, river titan. This is ultimate apocalypse, probably. Uh, yeah, all right. Mm -hmm. Some terminators with with those uh, Volkai cannons. Yeah. A dark elder, all right. Probably also ultimate apocalypse. Ah, uh, yeah, I like this color. Purple color fits them so much, actually. <laughs> Agony Titan, all right. <laughs> Yeah, I I was like back in the old days. I like to use like this Agony Titan to scare off my enemies. Like global ability, you can just scare them, and everybody was like, oh, "I cannot fight this Agony Titan. My troops are running away." <laughs> yeah, I mean that's the ability when you use it. Call down a little bit uh, lesser. Like you can just use your uh, horn, like, and it would be just like it in that movie world at end and world at war something like that uh, in that movie where the aliens coming and that's the siren exactly the same siren and everybody just like screaming and losing morale like <laughs> all right uh, yeah uh i don't want to speak about that uh, but that was uh Echis with alliance uh, probably like we used to like do that for fun uh, inquisition uh, okay, Inquisition ladies. Oh, those are the witch hunters, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we can see some matchup here. Probably survi survival mode. We have some corn against Grey Knights here. Uh, monoliths. Monoliths. Uh, what is the name? Executioners. Uh, ex ex Exorcist chapter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They belong to the to the Inquisition, if I believe. Yeah, they are like Space Marines for Inquisition, like per personal Space Marines, just like a Grey Knights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that is who who they are. Uh, you can read about them in on the in the lore. So yeah, moving on. All right, we have uh, probably ultimate uh, unification mode here, survival. Oh yeah, I remember those Necrons, looking scary. Ah oh, yeah, Astral Knights. Damn, <laughs> fighting against Necrons just like in lore. All right, the, the, I, back in the old days, I used to like uh, do some uh, insane difficulties against AIs or even survival mode. But you cannot play against insane. On you, you must put uh, in survival. You even on hard is a challenge. Uh, depends which. Which things are you turning off? Uh, which add-ons are you using for your match? If you're gonna use, just probably disable heroic defense because it's gonna be terrible for you. You're gonna struggle and you're gonna say to yourself, "Damn, man, I suck at this game." But no, actually, it's really complicated. Like, uh, not, I believe not many players can stand against uh, heroic and short defenses. It's um, terrible, especially when you play harder, bro. You, there is no chance you get to beat that. So. Even by yourself, even with the ally, uh, one ally or two, even uh, hmm. because it will uh, double them, it will give them more infantry to fight, uh, it will give them uh, more challenges, you know. All right, uh, what is this? We have lamenters with the gravity guns, interesting. Ultimate apocalypse, uh huh? Oh, that's actually pretty cool. All right, I like this dude. They seem like a true lamenters. <laughs> Too bad they are such a sad chapter. All right. Uh, now we have Blood Ravens. Blood Ravens. Uh, yeah, this is a cool picture actually. I like it so far. I mean, who doesn't love those Space Marines? I have my uh, personal top five Space Marine chapters, but okay, uh, they can fit in my top five for sure. And why not? Uh, Bone Singer just singing. Oh, this was me playing with uh, Elder here. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I had to master all the factions. Like, even now uh, in some uh, like big mods uh, races, 
I mean, big mods for like a lot of races. I didn't like master all the factions yet because there is so much. Uh, uh, unification mod is like completely different play style than uh, Ultimate Apocalypse. Like you, you kind of play uh, similar as a Soulstorm, and then you just have some extra stuff like re more uh, relic units and stuff like that. So yeah, it's completely a different story, you know. Like uh, you need to f uh, master like over 30 factions, like. That's a lot. Who has the time for that now? I don't even have that much time. Back in the old days, maybe I had, but... Uh, no, not right now. Still, I know how to play with a couple of races, yeah. So I can give you a good match, if you see me on the battlefield. Uh, Commander Dante, yeah, sure. Uh, Black Templars, Sword Brethren Terminators. Assault Sword Brethren, actually. Uh, Ultramarine Titan, River Titan, yeah, that's cool. Ah, uh, it's me! It's me! Ariman, the Exile, or Azrek Ariman. Yeah, alright. Uh, Durukai, Dark Elder, shooting with those upgraded weapons of them. Uh, Warrior or Trueborns here? Trueborns, Trueborns. Yeah, Trueborns are like elite units of Durukai. Pirates, uh, sadistic pirates actually, those fellas. Uh, Corn Terminators. Grey Knights are here to stop them. <laughs> Nemesis Knight. Interesting, interesting. We got a lot of pictures. Oh, uh, Bio Titan, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, I had a picture where I in played the ultimate, ultimate Apocalypse, where I had like the full screen of them. Full screen. Like, you can do that ability when you go to the end game of the Tyranids, and you can just spam as much as you want, like as much as you like uh, Titans in anything. Yeah, like you have to go to the end game with those factions to do that. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh huh, still Tyranids. Aha, now we are playing a uh, unification mod, I believe. Yeah, and that's uh, from the Assassin Creed guy. That's him, actually. That's him. <laughs> that is his face. Yeah, all right. All right. <laughs> I don't know why did I take a picture of him. I probably I figured it out like, wait a minute. This face is familiar to me. I have to take picture, actually. All right. Uh, Basilisk Magnus, yeah, for anybody you don't know, like this is a, a endgame weapon. You can put rounds and you can shoot nukes with this, baby, alright? At your disposal, General! Alright, oh, that's a Warlord Titan, heavy class Titan for Ultimate Apocalypse. Uh, yeah, this Titan is also scary, just like an Imperator. Imperator is actually more scarier, but don't underestimate this titan also uh, this this baby knows how to kill things all right uh, we have some mantis warriors here i mean there is no chapter yet for unification mod but probably in the future i don't know maybe we can see them in the future because i saw them in the down of colossus in that mod i saw them uh, a vulcan that's a Vulcan Salamanders, all right, with his army, waiting to do some nasty stuff. And you can watch all of those battles on my channel, like uh, uh, fighting against insane AIs and stuff like that. Maybe even survival, I don't even know. Uh, uh, Tau, I used to play Tau, yeah, all right. Against uh, Steel Legion here, huh? Yeah, Tau against Steel Legion. <laughs> Seems like a nice battle, huh? Alright, grab your coffee, we're gonna still talk about this. Or your uh, sodas, juices, whatever, man. What do we have here? We have uh, Reclusia key, alright. Space Marines, Honor Guard in the background, some Titan, Warhound probably. Terminators even. I don't know what the hell this is, alright. Yeah, this is a cool picture. With the flag even. This reminds me of uh, Hell's Rich, but this chapter is Minotaurs, we can see Minotaurs. But similar to the Black Templars movie, Hell's Rich, alright. 
Ah, some white scars, uh, predator tank with conversion beam, sergeant with his uh, plasma gun, alright. What is this? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a Bane Lord uh, Titan, uh, which is like. That was the strongest Titan. Now you can even go for a bigger Titan than he might believe. Maybe no, maybe this is the strongest Titan for the World Eaters, yeah, that's that's the name of the chapter. He's shooting that big missile at you, actually. <laughs> yeah, that was scary, alright? Uh, I just wanted to take some picture and he he can fit, he can fit. But if you, like, use a right angle, alright, like I did here, he's shooting like nukes, bro. It's insane OP uh, Titan. Uh, like, uh, that's a demon titan, actually. Uh, what do we have here? Yeah, again, him without the uh, missiles. And now we have some Necrons here. I believe this was me playing Salamanders against Necrons uh, on some difficulty. Survival, yeah. We can see here my level uh, that is beginning. And this is, uh, what's the name of this unit, Zenich uh, squad, like Zenich sorcerer squad. Yeah, those fellas, you don't wanna like, <laughs> they can destroy you like, with ease bro. Uh, we can see some dead elders on the screen, yeah, they can deal with them easily. Against some sorcerer lord, ah, he's a... Uh, uh, sorcerer command unit for his terminators and we can see some pink horrors in the background man I love to play with, with the thousand suns and of course gray knights one of my favorite chapters would be those fellas here I mean I like all of the, the Warhammer races except for a couple of them but I don't want to name them so some of you won't like be angry at me because I'm like telling you the names of the factions ah that's a grandmaster doing his abilities Urgh. die die oh that's his scary face mod <laughs> activated now we have salamanders again in the against necrons here all right probably Ooh, looking good fellas all right Ha! Ah, and noise marines. You want some music to get loud? Then play as a noise marine, bro. Empress children, all right. Aha, we have this uh, Necrons. Yeah, as I said, like I wanna tell you a real story here. Uh, I sh I was showing my friend this uh, Necrons uh, here, and I wanted to like. Uh, show him about unification mode probably that, that is why I had this many pictures uh, on the screen of, of Necrons and I was sending him he was he, he was liking to play Necrons and uh, there was also another battle with him uh, this this is a uh, based on a true story we played ultimate apocalypse I believed and he was about to produce his Titan and I was like I already I am already prepared I am gonna send him like uh, deep striking units with uh, multilators, obliterators and in his castle and uh, I sent that uh, Lord of Change a uh, couple of Lord of Changes in his base he uh, he was playing IG he had like a lot of turrets and he had that building for a titan he was like rushing for a titan and I it's not like I f uh, felt it, but uh, we were playing like probably free for all uh, on eight player map, uh, four players, all right? Each one of us had like a one side unique. And I remember how I killed him. I killed him, uh, I he killed his base uh, for a Titan. I just immediately deep strike the uh, multilators in his and obliterators in his castle, delete his. Uh, Titan base when he his Titan was about 99% to to be complete and I destroyed his building and he was like fuck you fuck you Ariman and he just rage quit to delete his whole HQ and 
story, this story will never be old. Like, yeah, I just wanted to say that because that was based on the true story here. I, I would not lie about that. So yeah, <laughs> and that's the Lich Guards. All right, uh, Tomb Spiders. Yeah, we can see how much stuff are added for Necrons in this. Um, uh -huh, Harley Queens. And if you know how to play them, like Death Jesters can be pain in the ass also, yeah. Some shooter. Commander boys with weird boy, like uh, new units, like you cannot play them in classic Soulstorm. You have to like play Ultimate or I don't know, even Unification mod now. You can probably in Down of Colossus play them. Uh, mm -hmm. Maybe even in other Codex mods and stuff like that. This is me. Uh, having some caskins and plasma lemon rust in the background. Nice picture. Oh man, how I know to take a good picture <laughs> with the good moments here. Mm, lovely to see, lovely to see. Uh, probably me playing as a Tau now on the moon. <laughs> All right, uh, Blood Ravens today, the enemy is at our door. We know our duty and we will do it. Most legendary commander, Commander Boreal of the Blood Ravens. Ah, there he is. There is no time to be lost. Battle Brothers! <laughs> Blood Ravens, today the enemy is at our door. We know our duty and we will do it. No, it is the enemy who shall taste death and defeat. Most of our <laughs> Alright, that is him, Commander Boreal. Legend. Down of War will never die because this fella exists, alright? Uh, moving on, we have, uh, ooh, that's Artis, <laughs> King Artis of the, <laughs> with his Frostmore. Uh, Frostmore, I believe, uh, Lehman Ras is holding Frostmore, and that's Artis. That's not Artis. That's uh, Primer uh, Lionel Johnson with face of Artis, actually. That is him, very young. <laughs> All right, we have now. Um, I mean, that's artist before becoming undead, all right? <laughs> uh, we have now uh, Knights of the Dark Angels. Next picture, please. Ah, huh. uh, oh, there is a uh, Tech Priest Magos, uh, Supreme Tech Priest. Uh, with some Ultramarines together, trying to kill somebody, I don't know. Unification mod, all right. Oh, fighting against orcs. <laughs> That's a lot of orcs here. I see. Mm -hmm. Next picture, please. Then we have some Black Templars. Well, please, Yaki. All right, I see him. I see you. Uh -huh. We have Necrons. Illuminati Suka Force. <laughs> With... Christmas edition. Ah, all right, I see. Looking good. Then we have a breacher, five warriors breacher team with shotguns and uh, pathfinders and classic five warriors. They are like new troops made especially for like unification and ultimate apocalypse mod. Maybe they are in other mods. I don't even know. Uh, but for now, you can see them. In those two modes, moving on. <clears throat> yeah, they can have uh, drones now, even before. They have those turrets. This is like a survival, probably. I don't even know. Aha, some Black Templars. Yeah, I had so many battles. I cannot even uh, remember. Just I can just name a couple of them how it used to be like. I mean, I can remember everything. Who are you to tell me I can't remember? <laughs> uh, all right, now we have uh, Primaris Noise Marines. You have to use your Papa carries to create them, probably, um, if I can remember. Uh, then we have Imperial Fists. We have Dark Angels here with uh, Asmodai. It is I, Asmodai. Yeah, glorious fella. And some Primaris Marines with. Plasma guns, uh, Commander Boreal again reporting for duties. I don't know where did I take those pictures, but I have them. <laughs> uh, then we have uh, General 
we have Librarian mm -hmm. watching over his army. Um, so do not fear the Psy Terminators. Aha, we have um, what is the name of them? Uh, Salamander, but he's not a classic Salamander. He is coming from uh, Death Watch. Death Watch, yeah, all right. Death Watch Salamander here. A commander in a land raider. All right. Then we have the Justicer of the Dark Angels. You can play now as a fallen, um, fallen angels, fallen marines. They belong to Chaos. A thousand Suns. Uh, destroyer tanks, laser destroyers. We have Terminator Deathwing. All right. Uh, Grandmaster, commander of the Grey Knights, with his uh, Land Raider Crusader here. And then we have a uh, Grandmaster of the Dark Angels. You can see the differences. All right. Uh, I don't know what the hell was this, but it was probably a glitch in army painter all right oof looking good looking good fellas doom warriors never heard of them before but okay uh we have some corner berserkers here then fatal error ah yes that corpse of krieg with those flags okay true slavic indeed playing survival mode with a player against elder all right uh sink error detected it seems, but that's Lion. That's Lion for you. That's a new model. So this is how he looks now. Interesting. Better than before. Now he, he looks like an Ultra from the Warcraft 3 also. <laughs> before he, his face was like Artist, but now this is his face originally. And he truly looks like a Knight. Uh, then we have a Rogaldorn. Yeah, his new look also. He is standing in a heavy cover and thinking like, Did I did great, Emperor? I need to move on, move forward, my brothers. Aha, this is a, a ship cruiser from the Imperial Guard. Uh, then I played improved. Uh, yeah, this is down of four Colossens. Down of four uh, improved campaign mode. This is the new lock of uh, Gabriel Angelus here. That's uh, Sergeant, Sergeant uh, Mathiel, Sar Sergeant Mathiel, I, if I can remember correctly, Sergeant Major Mathiel, and that's a Librarian. He betrayed us in the journey, we played on Insane this campaign, uh, what else? Yeah, his new lock looks awesome actually, and his, his uh, power sword is very nice. <coughs> Alright, moving uh, next picture. Oh, that was me when I like used to spam like those Thunderhawks, deep striking unit stuff like that. I had too much economy. Look at this, bro. Woo! <laughs> yeah, we we can have uh, in campaign mode. We can have uh, Sergeant Mateel as a hero unit now. That's that's pretty cool actually. I like that part. I really did. Uh, yeah, we can see them here. That was his old face of Gabriel Angelus without a beard and mustache and now this is his new face all right just like in a down of four two actually that's a model from down of war two probably um and this is a face of down of four one this is how he used to look like all right uh, all right we can see oh yeah down of colossus bro <laughs> Like this was hilarious. You, you can also have like over 50 races in there. This was me playing with Blair. All right. And that's a Basilisk uh, Magnus, but it can jump in this mod. It can fly. <laughs> that was funny as hell, bro. I have a video that you can watch it on my channel. You just have to like search for it. Same goes for the rest of the battles. Maybe you can even find some multiplayer matches where I use the commentary uh, on the videos of the battle. So yeah. Uh, all right, moving next. Do we have any more pictures? It seems. Let me see. All right. Uh, no. That's the full collection of my pictures. Actually, I uh, missed so much battles. So much battle pictures 
pictures from so much battles but that is all i got and i will show you one more thing i'm about to show you some uh, tabletop my collection and friend uh, his army i'm going to show you that you will enjoy it. trust me those things also remind me of uh, good old times well some of those memories we can like move on we can never uh, return those memories again just memories nothing else but i had fun after all it was great i enjoyed and i will show you those tabletop army collection now all right uh, this is uh, my army my army of the dark angels all right yeah this is my army of dark angels as we can see here uh firstborn like next picture would be this some a couple of firstborn with uh, last cannons uh, cannons uh, plasma cannons multi meltas and even heavy bolters and missile launchers all right and then we have necron army which belongs to my friend this army belongs to my friend uh, that was also a great time we used to play on tabletop back in the old days but now we're gonna continue this journey because why the hell not i'm still going to play down four and i'm still going to play tabletop because why the hell not all right we can see his necron overlord here with his death marks with his uh, i don't know like uh, little scarabs uh, immortals with tesla cannons and yes uh, reaper weapons and what else of the pictures we got here journey we used to play 1v1 it was a great memory actually and another picture would be this uh, this is a cake with uh, uh, imperial uh, logo uh, with uh, with ultramarines here on on the top of the cake actually this was uh, uh, made for his birthday <laughs> party and i was impressed man i was impressed like this this was a good memory bro like 100% Warhammer stylish, all right. I, I enjoyed it so much, bro. Like, uh, good and old memories, bro. They will never gonna happen again. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. I had so much fun in this beautiful journey, and that's about it. And I would like to thank everybody who, like, uh, was on part of my journey. Like, uh, thank you. Thank you. And if you were, if you found yourself in these pictures, like I had many more battles, I didn't like uh, capture the screens of it. Too bad, too bad, because we had a lot of ba battles. I just named them a couple forgotten memories when I can like share these beautiful moments with you. I enjoyed. Yeah, it was great. Those things will never be replayed again. So yeah, yeah, it was fun. It was fun. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and bye. Uh, it's me. It's me. Ariman, the exile, or Azrek Ariman. I am a knight. I shall die. A knight. A naked knight, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Even now, I could cut through the five of you like carving a cake! Here, boy! Melt it down and add it to the others.